Yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought. What a prick. Turns out you were right. I gotta go. Thank you for this. Happy hunting, Donovan. Miss Lancaster's helping me with a side project. You get a name at Enzo? Yeah, Remy Duval. He's not only building the casino, he also owns all the land where it's being built. Remy Duval? The jackass on the radio? His family's been down here a couple hundred years. Thinks it makes him everyone's massa. According to this, he heads up the Southern Union in his spare time. The Southern Union's basically the fucking clan. You know, right before I shipped out, Father James was with some other folks protesting the fact that the city didn't have any black cops. Southern Union came in and kicked the shit out of everybody they could get their hands on. Day after, they spray-painted God hates niggers across the front of his church. If President Andrew Johnson had actually executed those traitorous fucks, we wouldn't have this goddamn problem. Enzo also mentioned Olivia Marcano. Olivia's an outlier. Old Southern money. She's the one that was married to Sal's brother, Lucho. At least until someone slit his throat. And she runs Frisco Fields. Ever since Lucho died. She expanded his drug business and opened a PCP lab. Hmm. And since a lot of mafiosos live up there, she probably just has a place they can socialize. Well, it's usually in the back of some business. I never knew the mob had women as capos. She's there to keep Duval in line. Only people these entitled pricks listen to are other entitled pricks. So who are you going to go after first? Duval. Since he owns the land where the casino's being built, killing him will muddy things up. You think hitting Olivia's businesses will help draw him out? I've known racist assholes like him my entire life. Black man like me running around terrorizing white folks. He ain't gonna be able to let that stand. His pride will bring him down. Hey, you know that bourbon's not cheap. Good luck out there. Long way from Point Verdun, aren't you, Bear? Decided it was time to branch out. Not really a lot for me in that organization anymore. So what's your new lie? Mind-melting narcotics. And I hear the best are coming out of Frisco. PCP. And it's cutting into my business. Okay. So where's the operation? Beats the hell out of me. But a while back, Miss Olivia Marcano hired a top-notch chemist named Bobby Bastian. Tasked him with upgrading her operations, which will make it impossible for the small-time cooks to compete. Hell, they even got taxis delivering their shit. If I can get to Bastion's dealers, maybe they'll give him up. Tell me something I can use against him. That ain't all. Word is Miss Marcano brought in a couple other eggheads from San Francisco. Get rid of them, and Bobby Bastion's gonna find himself nice and fucked. using taxis. Last I heard, the boss was keeping the cash drops at the dispatch garage. Here on out, I call the shots.
my kid grow his hair out that long, I'd whoop his ass. <laughs> And they still haven't fixed the lot in front of my place. My tax dollars at work. Don't really know what to say about that. That didn't sound right. something. Heard any good jokes?
asshole. Hmm, thought I heard something. Motherfucker got business to attend to. We're down another man. Crazy, or did you catch that too? Shit! God damn! Wonder where it picked that up from. couple of days for old Bobby Bastion. Far less of his product out on the street than he and Miss Marcano would like. Which sounds like good news for you. I mean, that doesn't hurt. What are things looking like at the lab? Is Bastion there? Yeah, and in a fucking state. Apparently, the Marcanos aren't too happy about the cash flow disruption. Yeah, well, let's see how they feel about losing their drug lab. And Bear, sell what you're gonna sell, but you better steer well clear of the hollow. No one. You know what I'm saying? Huh? Sounds like Olivia Marcano sold Mr. Bastion to a cow. All but threatened to cut the poor bastard's nuts off. Who the fuck she thinks she is talking to us that way? God damn. She wrong? You get a racket like this, you got one job. Keep the drugs moving. Ain't goddamn rocket science. You see something, holler. This place is a plum target. Check this out. Huh? Goddamn gladly. Oh, some bitch ain't breathing. Shit. Where'd he go? Keep nosing around. Wonder if he's over there.
out of here. Shit. Let's keep looking. Dead. Fucker took off. Woo! You done. Damn. Fuck Damn. Damn. You see him? Damn. Cut that sack of shit down. Over there! Shoot him for fuck's sake! Yes, up, motherfucker! Come on, son! Take the woman like a man! He reloading! Time you got a new partner, Bastion. One that's gonna let you focus on doing what you do best. All right. I'll cook for you. Welcome to the family. Only way we're gonna hold on to Frisco Fields is if you send some of your boys. Your wishes, my command boy. Consider it done. Black Lodge, there! Why'd I become a priest? Every bad thing you experience, every trauma, they, they never leave you. Sure, you might forget about them for a while, but when the next one comes along, no matter how slight, it brings everything back. It reminds you of the weight you've been lugging around. I knew I couldn't carry all that on my own. Jackie, a mutual friend sent me. <laughs> I figured Johnny was lying when he said he had a friend. The cloak and dagger act's a bit much, though. You know Donovan? You could say that. I'm a special agent with Treasury. The IRS is looking into Olivia Marcano? Pretty sure she's smart enough to pay her taxes. I'm investigating a man who works for her, Chester Moreau. From what I've been able to piece together, he finances the Southern Union. Figured those racist fucks had factored into this somehow. The man I'm after, Remy Duval, is a grand poopa or some shit. Whatever the connection, it's deep, it's secret and it's bringing in a lot of money. Much more than you'd expect from a territory like Frisco Fields. The Bureau looked into it for a while, but no one's talking. Trust me, I get my hands on one of those bastards, he's talking. I thought as much. Only other lead I have is that the Southern Union's got stashes of propaganda scattered around the neighborhood. Might not seem like much, but you hit those, you'll get the attention of the people who matter. Yeah. Rose starts losing money, he's gonna want to know why. I'll be back once I have something actionable. Here in the hall of the world. Sit your ass back down. We going for a ride. Who the hell are you? You want to live? You tell me all about Chester Moreau's operation. Hello? Uh, there's a mess of trouble here. Please help. Be advised. We've got an armed colored male spotted in Frisco Field. All units converge. Let me out! 
Don't be shy. Talk to me. You're about to kill both of us. Talk or this will go bad for you. I'll tell you what I know. Nothing. Stop wasting my fucking time. Whoa. You barely missed that, motherfucker. I can't tell you. You drive like a fucking asshole. Oh, I'm gonna fucking buff. Give it up, cocksucker! Oh, fuck me! But when you need someone to Oh, Jesus! Apple unit, pursuit is called off. Abandoned search and return to patrols. Repeat, pursuit is called off. Abandoned search. I can't tell you shit if I'm fucking dead. Christ! Some of our other Southern Union guys on a job for. Big old secret. You try and warn anybody, I'll find you. Snowflake, real fucking funny. Long time, huh? How's it going? Who was that? Snowflake, where you think you're going? Where you at? No. The hell?
Chester Moreau make his money. The family of supermarket. There, there's something going on there after hours. Whatever it is, Mr. Moreau's trying to keep it real quiet. You work for me now. Need anything? Did you learn anything? Hit those bastards pretty hard, and all I got was a single word. Bel Air. Hmm. You know something? That tracks. Moreau is the majority owner of Bel Air Supermarket. As soon as you started hitting those racist assholes, the phones lit up. No one mentioned the Bel Air by name, but I did get a time. 10 p.m. And enough circumstantial evidence to tie it all together. Whatever's going on, it's happening at that supermarket tonight. I'll look into it. Lincoln, listen. The thing some of those guys were hinting at, it's bad. Real bad. So go in quiet. We need to find out exactly what Moreau is up to, and we won't get another chance. You got it, Jackie. See you around here again.
Maybe we'll get something to eat after. Think you'll make it to Gates? Maybe. They're just getting started. Huh? On behalf of Mr. Moreau, Mr. Marcano, and the Southern Union, thank you for coming out tonight. Mr. Moreau has asked me to remind you. Again, this is a fine specimen, no visible injuries or scars, and examined personally by Mr. Moreau's doctors. Please, just let me go. We'll start the bidding at $1,000. Do I hear $1,000? $1,000. Do I hear two? $2,000? What are you doing with a fire? Where are the others? Jess has got them niggas around Frisco. Just make it fucking quick, jig motherfucker. Rest in peace, asshole. You want money? Is that what you want? Crust Almighty! Please, please, Lord, please! World War II Medal of Honor recipient, Major General Keith Ware, was killed. Something, something bad wrong. Hey. Oh. Here you 
you are. Just had my hair done. Didn't sound right. Make you beg for death, boy. Fuck you, you inbred mother. <laughs> Now I'm making a pee busy. <clears throat> got a body here. Be advised. We've got an armed colored male spotted in Frisco Fields. All units converge. <clears throat> Gotta be 
be here somewhere. All this new You can find Chester Moreau at the grocery store. How'd you find him? I had a hunch, so I sat on an apartment in the French ward that's listed under his youngest kid's name. Fucker's been holed up there. He slipped back into Frisco with some cronies in tow. I think he figures if Olivia doesn't get to him, you will. You all right? Fuck no. Those poor people. I've got an old friend from the State Department who's going to help him. But Moreau. Moreau. That asshole Remy Duval. They've got to answer for what they've done. All of it. They will. You have my word. Bobby Veal, don't let just any dipshit come in on this, you hear? Top-notch motherfuckers are all we deal with around here. Mr. Moreau's offering $500 to the man who kills that cocksucker. That nigga be stupid to come around here. All these men, all these guns, fuck. His ass would be dead before he knew what hit him. Just keep that thing loaded. Last thing we should do... Huh? Mm -hmm. Took down Bel Air and Frisco Fields. Just so we're clear, we'll not be using this place to fucking sell people. We'll find another way to make money from it. Absolutely. We'll take care of this one just like we did the other. You can bet on it. Remy Duvall, 
came from one of the most respected and wealthiest families in Louisiana. He invested in everything from oil wells to real estate, and he used his social status to get a radio program. Now, he used his radio show to preach about the collapse of polite society and the superiority of the Southern way of life. His family had been here for a couple of centuries, so his death was a shock. But even more shocking was the revelation that he was associated with the Southern Union, a group of wealthy racists who used their social positions to agitate against blacks. Remy Duval, he was crucified and then burned alive. How do you justify that type of behavior? Remy came from a long line of Southern cocksuckers, was always quick to trot out that war of Northern aggression and the South will rise again bullshit. Here's the thing about Remy. In 1965, he participated in the murder of four civil rights workers one of whom they decapitated. They never found her head, so fuck him, he got what he deserved. 